Two people in one body. That's right. And to think they only gave us three days to live. Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel, Tough Topic. My name is Brittany. I hope everyone is enjoying their day. And I have another fascinating story I wanna dive into. And it's a set of conjoined twins named Lupita and Carmen. In the past few days, I've been discussing conjoined twins, Brittany and Abby, and I must say there are loads of similarities, but they are very different. <laughs> So the 23-year-old twins are from Mexico. They moved to the U.S. when they were babies in hopes to get the best doctors and to also potentially get surgery to separate them. Bad, bad, bad idea. The one major reason why they decided not to separate is because doctors told their parents to forget it. It's not going to happen. They would spend the rest of their lives in the ICU both or one of them could pass away. The two ladies share reproductive system as well as a blood supply. However, they have two separate hearts, two separate brains, and they are attached by the torso. So I've watched many interviews with them and I find it so fascinating that although they can't read each other's minds, when answering a question, it's as if one of them is talking and the other knows exactly what one of them is going to say. Like their lips are moving at the same time word for word as the other. It was almost as if they were both speaking, but one was on mute. Take a look. If one goes to jail, does the other one have to sit in jail too or what happens? I don't know. Never been to jail. They do reveal that they have a way of reading each other's emotional state as well. But when Lupita is bothered, Carmen will know without even asking her. Carmen and Lupita have very different personalities. Lupita tends to be more of a jokester while Carmen is more serious. Speaking of serious, Carmen is dating a guy named Daniel, which she met on a dating app and she has openly said that on her YouTube channel. Carmen says that she was very transparent upfront about her physical appearance and her boundaries. Although she has dated him for a couple of years now, she's made it clear that there's no physical romance. He's just an emotional partner. Lupita, on the other hand, says that she is asexual, which means she does not have an appetite for a partner and very little interest in sexual activity. So I don't feel like it will ever be a problem with Lupita just accepting the title of the third will in this situation. But then you have to think about considering the other sister's boundaries when it comes down to personal time. So Carmen is in college. Lupita, she has dropped out. They both have jobs. They are very popular on YouTube and TikTok. And for the most part, they are very open to answer any burning questions you have, as long as it's nothing too personal. The twins were introduced to the world from TLC, Together Forever, Conjoined Twins, Inseparable, a few years ago. But... They really made their names known by appearances on the Jubilee channel, answering questions and being interviewed by Anthony Padilla. The way some of the world may look at these ladies is not the same way most of us look at them. When you actually listen to their stories and hear their perspective on life, you realize that they are just like the rest of us. They can do like the rest of us. The twins are thriving and I'm sure more is to come in the future for them. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe for more fascinating stories and updates. Bye for now.